Hello Greystone, this is Avery Smith and welcome back to another Teacher Spotlight. On this week's Teacher Spotlight, we interviewed Polly Ann Rhodes. Miss Rhodes graduated from Albemarle High School and then continued her education at Lenore Ryan College for her bachelor's degree and then received her graduate degree from North Carolina State University. Miss Rhodes has been married for 25 years to her husband David. She's an early riser waking up at 5.15 making her drive to Greystone at 6.30. And lastly, her favorite animal is a lion. She described them as fearless and strong. And now learn more about Miss Rhodes in our interview. Hey everyone, on today's Teacher Spotlight we have Polly Ann Rhodes and she is our new middle school principal. Mm -hmm. So we're going to ask some questions to get to know her a little better. So first question is, what is one thing you love so far about Graystone? Oh my gosh, I love the people. I, I just love the mindset that everybody is here to be excellent and have a college focus and I don't know, I just, everybody, is, it has made me feel like I'm part of a family. It's not a job, it's like coming to work with my family. So it's been really nice meeting everybody and they have great attitudes and a wonderful outlook on what it's like to educate children and students. We love our Greystone family. <laughs> um, our next question is going to be a little more personal, but what made you get into the teaching world? Gosh, a long time ago, I just really wanted to make a difference in the lives of people in general. And um, I began as a physical education teacher, mm -hmm. and I worked in an elementary school in Raleigh. Uh, several elementary schools, but my last school I worked for 16 years in elementary school and I absolutely loved it. And um, throughout the years I just really enjoyed um, teaching other teachers how to be great. Um, a lot of people have a really bad mindset about physical education teachers, like they just roll out the ball and go play basketball, go play soccer and go walk the track and I just was not like that. I wanted kids to really learn how to love moving their bodies in a fun way so they would continue that for a lifetime. So I love the mind, working with your mind and being smarter but also making your body healthy so you can live a long life and I've just always, I've just, it's just always been part of who I am. Yes. Okay, next question is what are some of your favorite hobbies? I work. <laughs> I don't really have a lot of hobbies <laughs> but since I moved here I do live on Lake Tillery. Oh. And so there have been a few days where I was like, I just need to be on the water. So going for a boat ride or pulling my kids on the tube or going skiing. I went skiing the other day oh for the first God. time in a long time. Oh so I just, uh, I love to move. So anything that has me moving around, but really my family is my hobby. Whatever I can do to help them yeah. be successful and have a good day and just be a mom. I just, that's kind of my hobby. Yes. Okay, and we'll do one last question. It's going to be kind of a fun one. So if you could go on any vacation, what would it be? Oh gosh. Um, well, I hate to be cold. Me too. So I would not Me go too. anywhere cold. <laughs> Me either. <laughs> um, so I'd probably go to some place that had like the blue waters where you see the the houses that sit over the yes. water and oh and you can look down and see the fish and the yes. animals in the sea. Just kind of an escape from telephones and um, I don't know, I just think it would be great to escape and just sit and look at the beauty of, of creation. Some more tropical. So yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, well that's going to wrap it up. Thank you so much for taking Thank the time. You. Thank, Thank you. Thank you guys for watching. <laughs>